At the opening of Parliament in October, PM spoke about building an inclusive society and sketched the government's vision for a stronger Singapore and a better home. Budget 2012 sets out our directions and takes significant steps towards achieving this vision. We are restructuring and upgrading our economy so that workers can enjoy higher incomes and every Singaporean family can aspire to move up. We are also introducing new initiatives and deploying more resources to uplift and support lower and middle income Singaporeans. But we all know that building an inclusive society is not just about government redistributing resources to help the poor. It is about building a society where, at its heart, people retain a deep sense of responsibility for their families and seek every opportunity to improve themselves and do better. Where employers treat workers with respect, value their contributions and reward them fairly. Where the more successful step forward to help others in the community because they feel for their fellow citizens and where Singaporeans actively participate in causes that make this a better society. An inclusive society will only blossom if we grow this spirit of responsibility and community. It has to be about how we go about our lives as Singaporeans, like the people that you will see in this video. Because It's a bit of risk taking as well. They already started almost six months and they don't see that uh, they're making money. Yeah, they want to close shop. To me personally, I see there's opportunity. Everywhere we go, it's difficult to get uh, halal rates everywhere. So let's say there's a market. So I approach them say, why not? You don't close the, the business, why don't you buy over the business, you buy over the franchise. Can you tell me your philosophy of hiring staff? Just employ the seniors, that's what we are doing. We pay the market rate, yeah. We don't say you are older, you pay less, no, you are no. One of our patients is baking and pastries and all that. I receive a letter from a you know, government said that WSQ we can you know, get any courses that we want to upgrade ourselves. I want my own way that I do myself because I love to eat bread. I told them that I'd rather stay at home. See. If you send me there, if I'm not happy, you give me the best of medicine, so I will, it won't work. First and foremost, you must be happy where you are. <laughs> Very <laughs> good. 
opportunity, improving ourselves, compassion. These are the defining characteristics of an inclusive society and must be our common purpose as Singaporeans.